Okay, so I'm going to do a pour on a record with these three colors, pink, purple, and yellow at the request of a uh, special friend who's just been through a terrible time and seems to be coming out the other side and I'm so happy for her and so I put a request out on Facebook and asked what three colors um, everybody would like to see and uh, Brenda posted that she wanted purple, pink, and yellow so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to add some white. Ooh, that might be a bit too much white. Put some back. All right, start with my purple. Now these colors have all been mixed with pouring medium, a little bit of Floetrol, and dimethicone. And you can see there's some cells forming already, I think. So the yellow and pink should probably make a pretty orange color. And the purple always looks pretty with yellow. These are kind of Easterish colors. So a little bit more white. And repeat. comes the fun part. I might be making a really big mess here, but I have this on a Lazy Susan. I'm going to spin it and pour the paint. What do you think? You ready? again. I thought I was going to have too much paint, but I don't think I have quite enough. So I'm just going to pour a little bit more.
give it a little torch. So what do you think, Brenda? You like it? I hope so. It's probably going to take a long time to dry. I think the paint's pretty thick, but kind of pretty. So yeah, I'm just going to um, zoom in and give you a uh, closer look. camera's on a tripod so it's kind of hard to move. It's not working very well at all. Might have to just move the, the art. There we go. Okay, so I'm just going to let it develop and I'll be back in a few minutes to show you how it looks. Alright, so it's been about 10 minutes and it hasn't really changed much. I did have to move it. It wasn't level so it was pouring off the side. So I moved it over. I think it's level now. It doesn't seem to be moving. So I like the color combination, but I don't particularly care for the results of the spinning pour. But what I like isn't always what everyone likes. So um don't know. We'll see if Brenda likes it. It's got some really cool parts to it, and it would look kind of cool, I think, as a clock. So yeah, that might be a good idea. But in the meantime, I think I'm gonna do another one. Um, in a different combination of colors. So I just have to mix up my paint. But I'll probably do that in a new video. So um, I hope you enjoyed this one. I will post, I will either post pictures of the dried piece at the end of this video or I will um, uh, post it on Instagram or Facebook. So uh, follow me there if you aren't already. And thanks again for watching. Bye for now.